saw the green areas of roads covered in snow, pretty much all of Region 8. This is every major highway and interstate in Northeast Arkansas. Now let's check on road conditions this morning across Region 8. Meteorologist Aaron Castleberry is in the George Pell Storm Tracker. And Aaron, what does it look like out there right now? Diana, I'm just going to tell you just a point blank. If you do not have to get out this morning, do not get out. Roads across the, the entire city are snow covered. I've seen so many people pulling out of dry, out of parking lots, skidding and skidding on this ice. It is that dangerous out here this morning. And also the visibility dropped dramatically with this band of snow moving through. You, you're going anywhere from 10 to 15 miles per hour at the most. There's a truck in front of me that's starting to skid on the snow. I'm heading down north on Redwood Boulevard, just turned off at Middleton, heading back towards Arkansas State. And every road looks like this. It is snow covered, it is slick, the wind is blowing really hard, it's really cold outside, and with the blowing snow, visibility is below a mile. I cannot even see the bridges up there, just go over the train tracks to get to ASU. So if you have to get out today, Take it slow, but if you do not have to get out, by all means, stay inside and enjoy the snow day. For now, I'm live in Jonesboro, Aaron Castleberry, Reef Bank News. Thank you, Aaron, and be careful on those roads. We'll check back in with you a little later. Now, let's head out to Destiny Quinn in Jonesboro. Destiny, how are the roads where you are? Good morning, Diana. Yes, I am live right up in East Johnson in the Hilltop area. We haven't seen snow like this in several years. It's freezing out here. I'm going to step out of the camera so you can get a better look at traffic. Driving conditions are very dangerous right now. Please stay home if you can. We can't emphasize this enough. Trust me, you don't want to drive in this. Jonesville V911 Director Jeff Presley said to use caution if you're in the Brooklyn area. Some traffic signals may be out of service. Some traffic lights won't cycle correctly because of snow on the sensors. Police are also reporting problems at Red Wolf and Johnson. Snow plows are working to clear the intersections. Presley also reminds you to turn on your headlights. I just checked the temperature outside. It is 7 degrees. That is dangerously cold. Don't stay outside for too long. For now, I'm going to duck right back into my one vehicle. Reporting live in Jonesboro, Destiny Quinn, Region 8 News. Thank you, Destiny. Trust and warm out there. Jet buses in Jonesboro are canceled today because of the bitter weather. Sanitation and city businesses were already off for President's Day today. Firefighters battled freezing temperatures early this morning at a house in Blyville. Crews responded to the fire on West Pecan Street just before 3.30 a.m. They say the fire started in the attic. Crews managed to knock down the fire and return to service just before 6. We're also taking a look at power outages in Arkansas. Adam Jones is in the newsroom with the latest information. Good morning, Adam. Yeah, good morning, Diana. Energy Coffee Arkansas man. says that about 3,200 Arkansans right now are out of power. Here in Region 8, Mississippi... He loves Bar watching County, it snow. Are being impacted. Mm -hmm. Energy hopes to have the power restored by noon. Now, this is a live look at the Craighead electric outage. Right now, there's around 113 <laughs> out of power in Craighead County. I spoke Let's see if I can get a shot through, through the... Oops, I need that. <laughs> well... Cold out there, y'all. Today, the Salvation Army in Jonesboro is about half full. There is a plan in place if more space is needed. The center is located at 800 Paint Avenue. It will be open 24 hours a day through this Friday, all business. On You're watching a couple of little birds. They've been right there. They're gone now. Trying to get shelter. We got some snow. Oh, it ain't done yet. I don't know how many inches, but see it's drifting up over there. I'm just going to go closer and we back this up. There. 
Comes a truck. Winter's first hurrah and last hurrah, I guess, here for Arkansas. But it's snowing, y'all. We're happy about it. A lot of people are not, but I am. Oh, I thought that was that little bird, but I guess they filmed. They went somewhere else. I don't know if it's showing up. I can't see that well. Hope it is. Oops. I've been, I've got about an hour of sleep. Couldn't sleep. I just kept getting up, looking out the windows. Didn't do much last night. Started in this morning real early. Let's see if I can. Could we should have got this for Christmas? Yeah, now. Now it feels like Christmas. Now, Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> I can see it glistening. I hope it's showing up good. We got a blowing, <coughs> blowing snow. I know it's cold. I know it's all that and stuff, but we need this. Maybe to help purify the air. <coughs> Lord knows we need it. You can see that. Well, I want to share this with y'all. Every time I see the snow, it takes me back to when I was growing up in Michigan. I think the last time we got this kind of snow is was 2013. We got a blizzard that year, for, and it was right on Christmas. It was awesome. So it's been a long time. Long time coming. Now everybody don't know what to do. Whoops. Okay, I accidentally done something. I hit the button. This phone is so sensitive. I'm going to finish, finish my video here. I hope you all had a great Valentine's Day. We just hung out at the house. As always, <laughs> roads have been bad since the ice, so, you know. So we had some ice before this, which is kind of making it. We're supposed to have this again Wednesday, but this time they said probably a winter mix. So hopefully it'll just be a snow. I won't record her son. I'll turn it back this way. Anyway, I got about an hour's sleep. I feel like crap, but I love, I love the snow. Maybe I'll record some after a while. Some more. Get some out back and stuff like that. Romeo. Romeo. Hey. Romeo, what do you think? What do you think, baby? What do you think about this? No. You were about it, huh? You was... 
uh, you was uh, two years old last time you seen Big Snow. 2013. Wait a minute. 1456. No. I mean, wait a minute. Uh, 1230. Yeah, he was two years old. He was two years old. Yeah, you're right. He's a baby still. Yeah, the mommy and daddy is still baby. He's still our baby. So here's our weather forecast. And my little tree. Yeah. It should be it should be a winter scene on there instead of Valentine's. I might do that. Filling in again, he said. Hope I got it loud enough where everybody can hear. I don't think my video will get flagged for Look showing there, right the weather. Really getting it. Yeah. Let's see if I can get it from here. Yeah, this is a blizzard. It's blizzard. It's blowing off the house, too. Yeah. Hey, Brian, I'm on Johnson Avenue here in North Jonesboro, and it is white out conditions out here. You can barely see. I'm at Fisher Street. I still Valentine's stuff light. over you there. You cannot see the main mm. street uh, light up there either. It is that windy, and the, the snow is moderate heavy right now, but with that wind, it is making things ten times worse. I've seen several cars getting stuck there, getting out there with a car that was turning off a, re a truck, turning off a Red Wolf onto Johnson there in that little curve to who was stuck. And by the, I don't know how he got, uh, got out. He finally made his way out. And got back onto Johnson Avenue. Now, cars are going slow, and that's the best thing to do if you're out and about this one. Go slow. Take your time. Do not get too close to the car in front of you. Look at it. You can barely see the cars that are in front of us right now here on Johnson Avenue. The best thing is to stay inside this, uh, today. Enjoy the snow at home. For now, I'm live in North Jonesboro. Aaron Castleberry, Three Day News. Well, thank you, Aaron. It looks like that snow is coming in sideways with those pretty strong winds. So we're going to continue to see this way for a good while. You see a lighter snow there along the west of Highway 67. Your temperatures, one degree in West Plains, Mount Home, eight is what it is in Jonesboro. But check out your wind chill all the way through the afternoon at five to ten degrees. There's three o'clock. That's three yeah. hours from yeah. now. Temperatures and feels like temperatures with that snow continuing. Between now and three o'clock, you see those lighter shades of blue. That says the snow tapers off between five. three and five. Your temperatures topping out around eleven today in Jonesboro, and all that snow out of here by seven. But keep in mind these north and northwest. Oh, that bird! Keep that snow caked up. So blow it across the highway as well. We're going to see several inches of snow on some of those streets and those bridges, overpasses, which could make them impassable. Now, late tonight and early tomorrow, we are looking at wind chills of 10 to 15 degrees below zero. So our forecast is in good shape, in great shape. We're looking at three to six inches That's of snow. That's cold for down. Arkansas. Eight inches of snow in that darker shade of blue east of 67 for Jonesboro. Uh, West Memphis, Blyville, some of us may get closer to 10 inches of snow by the time it all tapers off later on this evening. Look at that snow covered street there in Walnut Ridge. You've got some slow traffic. That's where my sister lives. For the next couple of days. And right as we start to see that sun on Tuesday and it starts to try to melt some of that snow away, we get hit with another round of snowfall. And look at that. that snow one. Tuesday, there we are on Wednesday. Round of snow coming in. Some of it could be heavy at times, especially for our southern counties. And as of right now, it looks like another four to eight inches of snow is not out of the question, although there's some uncertainty. Some model nine is trying to bring in some more wintry mix into our eastern counties. Well, the good Lord did answer prayers. He says, okay. 
You ask me. You've been ask. You've been uh, begging for it. So you, here you go. I haven't heard any thunder though, like they said, you know, or thunder snow. I haven't heard that yet, any at all. Look at that zero. <laughs> Hope I'm not boring y'all, but word deals thrilling to us. Yeah, so they're saying something about some sleet now. Mm, no, don't like that. They were going to go right back into some rain, and then it's going to melt off. It's going to be gone, because that's Arkansas for you. Anyway, I want to share that with everybody. Let y'all hear our weather news, our forecast. So maybe record some more tomorrow. I mean, tomorrow. I'm so tired I can't even talk. Hang on a second. I keep hitting the wrong button. Anyway, I had to get back to him. He's he's just watching that snow drift and blow. He's just amazed. We keep a pad down for him, but look where it's at, you know, just in case, because he's 10 years old. I think he, a long time ago, he used it like one time, that's all. <laughs> He'd lay on it, though. Okay. Oh, goody, I didn't hit the wrong button. Here is the rest of my Christmas stuff. Um, so there, and it's there, right in this, these two part right here. And then underneath there, oh my goodness, here, let me show you. Here's a scan of my room. I got in here and worked real hard last night. There's still a mess over here. And my closet. This is where my Christmas stuff is stuff supposed to go. Ah. Um, there's my totes. But anyway, I'm gonna bring you over here if I can get over here. I wanted to clear this where I could see the snow. See, in my craft room, there's double window here, and it's just beautiful. But you can see. Let me see if I can. Yeah, I'm zoomed all the way out. Here's our backyard. I hold this still. I don't mean to make this video very long, but I just want to share this with y'all. Now, this is a big deal to us. As long as no one gets stranded or hurt, you know, we're, we're all cool. <laughs> Now this here was a storm shelter thing that was here when we moved and um we don't use it though just you can see where the i say we can see where the snow has blowed and bank, banking up against against there and i know not a very good um scenery but you know, i'm just showing you the snow I see it better from here. Uh oh, it's like a, a wreck. That's not good. There's our um, storage shed. The snow, snow, snow. I gotta make me some coffee. It's really, the temperatures though are really, really, really cold, uh, dangerously cold, and I hope the kids, hope the parents, you know, watch after the kids and not let them stay out in it very long, because 
Well, we're not used to it. And as our weatherman, uh, our chief meteorologist, Ryan Vaughn says, you know, frostbite is a real thing. And it darn sure is. Because they're going to, you know, they're going to have to get out and play a little bit. So anyway, I'm going to quit, hopefully not boring y'all, but I'm going to let y'all go. Just want to share you all with, you know, our beautiful snow. Um, well, I wish I could get out there and show y'all. Hey, there's a little bit bigger flakes coming down. I don't know if you can see that or not. But every once in a while we get some big, big flakes. I missed the big snow. I was trying to sleep some, but I missed the big snow. But that's okay. I would like that. Got that all recorded. Anyway, you I'm going to let you go. And thank you so much for watching. I hope it was a little bit entertaining for you. I just really wanted to share. I love you all. Have a very safe and blessed. What is this, Monday? Yes, Monday. I will try to get some more. Some more, um. Maybe I'll get some more after a while. I don't know. But if I don't, I have a blessed Monday. I love you all. Mwah. Had to just get a little bit more of it. What is really snowing out there, y'all? Look at that. My goodness. It is snowing hard. I know I can't video or I can know I can't record it all. What do you see, Rome? Hmm? What is it, baby? Huh? You see the snow? You see it? Woo! What's it doing out there? What's it doing? I'm going to get back on my banky. You getting on your banky? Yeah, he's getting on his banky. He's going to lay down on his banky out of his bed. He's silly. He's just silly. He's a silly little boy. He's going to be out of his blanky. We're going to lay by his bed in front of his bed. <laughs> He's so silly. Look at his bed. I know I shared this in a video a little while back. Probably a year ago. Um, I got his bed on an online auction. A different one than what I buy from now. And um, they showed these beds. And I was like, oh my goodness. And they didn't say what kind they were, where they come from. And so I bought, you know, I went in and bought this one for Romeo. And I'm so glad I did. Oh, my gosh, it's made so good. He loves it. And it's a red and black buffalo glow check. <laughs> I got red and black buffalo check all over my living room. And some in the dining room do, but <laughs> it's um the bed is Ellen DeGeneres. Yeah, it's Ellen. Oh, uh, she it's a big um what do you call it advocate or whatever for pets and stuff, and she uh, she has a, a line of pet products, obviously. With uh, along with her stuff, anybody watch her? You know she sells underwear. She, somebody's always on there 
on her shoulders, got her underwear on. It's funny. But yeah, the bed is Ellen DeGeneres has got a tag on it on the side of it. I thought that was so pretty cool. And I like watching her show. Anyway, he's gonna, gonna try to sleep, but I wanna just share some more and here we go. Blowing, it's snowing. Hi again. I'm just going to add this little bit on to my video. I was going to not do any more, but I wanted to show you how much more snow we got. Um, I can't really tell. It's so light. White and bright. <laughs> I can't really tell uh, what I'm filming here, but um, I threw some bread out. <laughs> I wasn't going to get outside. Threw some bread out there on the porch, and uh, it's covered up almost all of it now. But that's how much snow we've gotten, y'all. It's, whoops. Uh, see if I can you can see by our fence there I would like to take there's my, my my plant that was my mother's um um moss and it blooms every year and it looks it let you know moss it just come right back out every year um there's you can see in the back of a or that's our suv there um see it's, it doesn't really have a lot of snow the snow is a blowing snow is what it is and that's why it's drifting and you can see where it's up to our fence our little fence that we have in the front we just it's nothing fancy. It's just, it was for the babies. That's still for Romeo, you know. For Romeo and Izzy. And so, as you can see there, it's my tire. I put flowers in every year. Got one on both sides of the our yard. And just show you, uh, Gary went ahead and left the little lanterns out until... <clears throat> Deal. Here's here's some kids hollering. Uh, we have a place here, and it's not too far from where my son and daughter-in-law lives and my grandbabies. Um, it's called uh, well, it the name of the street is um, Hill Street. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's Hill Street, and um, our mayor has uh, had the police department and all to uh, block the road because it's it is it goes way down here hill. There's there's a real steep hill there, and uh, it's perfect for sledding. And that's what he did. He um, he had them to block that off so the kids could get out there and sled down hill. <laughs> down Hill Street. It's just pretty awesome, you know. And uh, it's just barely snowing now. Uh, this would be round one. And it's about to wrap up and get over with. But we've got this much snow. And if... If uh, all goes well and we don't get uh, the sleet that they're talking about, could be in the next part. Um, <clears throat> well, we could very easily get, whoops, I thought I stepped on Romeo's tail. Uh, we could easily get this much again um, Wednesday into Thursday. So tomorrow it's not going to do anything, but we we are cold, 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 cold here. 
So nothing, uh, <laughs> something, you know, something really major changes the things. Um, it's not going to melt any. So what have we got now? Oh, look it. Oh, can you see the bird on the trees? Oh, oh nice and fat. Gary, he's gone out to the, to his shop to get, um, to get the, the uh, bird, uh, bird seed. Oh, I think he, he took it with him. Good. Good, good, good. Oh, I wish I could get out there and do that. I'm still in my jammies. Y'all, I've been wearing the same pajamas for about three days now. Oh, there's another one. Can you see there? I love birds. I absolutely do. Oh, there's a... Oh, I seen um, two cardinals a while ago. Oh, flew away. Shoot. But I even forgot what I was saying. They're flying around now. It's because the snow is lit up. Well, it's not. It's just very, very. It's just showering. That's what it is. But it's still blowing sideways. Um, that's why they're venturing out now, trying to find something to eat. They got their their, their feathers all fluffed up real big, like you know, they're a big old fat bird. You know how they do. I love birds. Uh, oh, looky, look at them. Oh, they're, um, oh my goodness. Uh, <laughs> my robins. I know my birds. I'm just still so sleepy. I, I can't talk, even think. I can't talk either. Well, where'd he go? Oh, shoot. This is what I miss of where we used to live. Um, I could I could always birds we had birds we had so many birds over there we really did and uh, here we don't I mean we do but it's different we lived in a lived in a mobile home and you could see things better than that. I don't know. And there's Gary. He's trying to shovel a you know, shovel walkway. Well, that's how much snow we got. Yay. You know, what for COVID, I'd make some snow cream. Look how powdery it is. See, it's just powder. So it's not going to make a good snowman. So... <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's just powdery snow. It's so easy to shovel. Look at that. It just. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Lord, we got. Can you see his legs there? We got. I put I put a thing on Facebook. I think it was. And I said. <laughs> I said we got like over eight, in, over eight inches. Oh yeah, we got over eight inches. That's all the seed we got. Shoot. Just gonna put it in the little bird feeder for the babies, for the birdies. Uh -oh. What did he have in there? One of them bulb things? Uh, don't want to hurt them babies. Romeo's going to be not getting out there. Mm. It's not very much seed. Mm. 
I wish I would have thought. I, I usually always do. We, we always do. Just we didn't remember this time. But y'all, I'm not going to keep you. Um, I know this video is going to be kind of long and probably <laughs> not very many is going to watch it. But uh, I just, well, I'm just stayed up all night for this, y'all. And I'm just so happy of seeing the snow. Maybe I'll get some sleep tonight and do some filming tomorrow. Maybe I even get to get out tomorrow for just a little while anyway. I plan on doing that. So I'm going to end the video right here. And I might make another video later. Uh, not tomorrow. That's what I'm trying to say. So I love you guys very much. And uh, hey, come on. Don't thumb down me. Don't thumbs down me. Um, you know, because... Snow is a beautiful thing. It really is. It's pure. It's clean. It's fresh. You just want me to cut. <laughs> so anyway, y'all. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. appreciate you. And hey, I hope you're getting what you want and what you love wherever you are. And my, the ones that gets a whole lot of snow and don't want it. Bring it back. Bring, bring it on down here to Arkansas. We'll take it. <laughs> Too bad you just can't do that, right? Love you guys. Take care. Please be safe wherever you are. I love you. I know this this snow um, uh, this snowstorm here has affected a lot of people, a lot of states. So, we're not the only ones. Love y'all. God bless. Mwah.